so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! We are at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium in Tacoma, Washington. And today, we are going to see some awesome animals. Let's go! Got my member's card. All right. Okay, come on. This is going to be so much fun. Okay. Here we go. This is Cindy, and what do we have here, Cindy? That is a Pacific herring. Ooh, and we are about to go feed some penguins. Did you see how we walked up really low? You gotta stay low so then they don't get scared. are these, Cindy? These are Magellanic penguins. Ooh. A lot of people think that they need ice and snow, but these guys live in Argentina and Chile in an environment that's very similar to here. Ooh. Argentina and Chile. And so they love to swim, it looks like, huh? They do. These guys spend all winter out at sea, and they can swim really fast, and they have to swim really fast, so they can chase fish, which is what they eat in the ocean. Ooh, like these. Polar bears are the color white. That polar bear, yeah, his name is Boris. And he's 31 years old. Boris was rescued from a circus, a traveling circus in Mexico. And it's really important to have ice so polar bears can hunt off of and get it seals in the Arctic. So we should be really aware of what we do to our planet so polar bears can have a lot of ice. Is? Yeah, that's a tiger. Meow. That's a really big kitty cat. <laughs> that's actually a Sumatran tiger to be exact. And there's only about 300 left on this entire planet in the wild. So here at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium, this tiger is an ambassador. So this is Sarah. Hi. And Sarah, what do we have here? This is Gonzo, and he is a tree climbing anteater. And here at Point of Zoo and Aquarium, we're training him to be part of our Wild Wonders Outdoor Theater show that's Ooh. brand new this summer. Hey, Gonzo. So what are we yeah. gonna? Yeah, what are we gonna be doing right now? You're gonna help me train Gonzo to eat vanilla yogurt Ooh. from a tube. Okay. So, so this is something that he will love to do. Hold okay. that up Hold right it. up to his little nose. Okay, here and I go. And he's gonna slurp that vanilla yogurt Ooh. right out with his super long tongue. Whoa. Check that out. Look at Gonzo's tongue, it's so long. 
Now, of course, in the wild, Gonzo would not eat vanilla yogurt. He would eat ants. And he has really big claws that he can use to break open ants' nests and termite mounds. And then he'd use his long tongue to slurp those bugs right up. Ooh, yum, that looks pretty tasty. Yeah. So Gonzo has been around people his whole entire life. And when he first came here, we started training him to be part of the show. So that's why he's so comfortable hanging out with us out here. Yeah, he seems like a really great and fun anteater. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm making some diets for the meerkats. Meerkats? I love meerkats. What else are you going to do today? Well, you know what? I was going to do some enrichment. Do you want to help me? Yeah. Excellent. Let's so, go over to the exhibit. OK. And what's enrichment? Enrichment is giving our animals choices, things to do, things to play with, kind of like kids on a playground. Ooh, that sounds fun. I like playing. So let's give them some choices. OK. Let's put these wiffle balls okay. and the blue pool on exhibit. OK. All right. Wiffle balls, blue pool. Got it. This place. This is the exhibit from the habitat of where meerkats play. Whoa. <laughs> okay, anywho, back to it. Wiffle balls, blue pool. Right. Okay, let's put these in here. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun to see the meerkats play with these wiffle balls that we're putting in here. Okay, and the second one. Okay, here we go. Let's see what else she wants us to do. Hey, okay, here you go. Thank you. What else do you have well, for I've us? Well, I've got some more fun toys. Let's put these out on the exhibit as okay. well. Okay. Where should I put these? Wherever you want. Ooh, this is going to be fun. Where should we put these? Here, come on. Okay, let's see. Oh, let's see. I think the yellow one should go. Oh, do you see this? Let's put it right there. Huh. And then, ooh, come back here. Let's put the pink one right, let's do this one right here, actually, right next to the yellow one. And the really big red one, let's put over here. Here, I'll meet you over that way. <laughs> it's like I'm a meerkat, watch. Okay, let's see what else we need to do. Come on. Okay, is that all? No, Blippi, let's okay. take the fun up a notch. Let's add some food enrichment to the toy enrichment. Ooh. Here's some mealworms. It's like chocolate for meerkats. Ooh, yum. Look at this. Ooh, yum. So where would you like me to put this? You know what? Let's sprinkle some in the wiffle balls. Okay. And if you want to put some elsewhere in the exhibit, you can do that too. Okay. It's kind of like a search and find because <laughs> we'll put some right here and then we'll hide some for them to find it okay so spread out the wiffle balls and let's sprinkle some on top of the wiffle balls Wee! <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna be fun <laughs> okay Whoa. okay okay there's a little bit more let's put some right on this ledge Mmm, those look tasty. Okay, let's just put the rest in here. All right. I think we're ready. Are we all done? Great job, Blippi. Let's let them out. Okay. is a dromedary camel, and his name is Winchester. <laughs> dromedary camels are found in Africa, and if you're three years old and 36 inches or taller, you can ride camels at Point Defiance Zoo. They're really soft. Wow. We are in the Marine Discovery Center, and this place 
has amazing sea creatures, and we can actually touch them. See? You can touch, but with only one finger, okay? Ooh, look at these right here. Ooh, that was scary. <laughs> that scared me. Ooh, and look, here's a snail. Hello. Hi, little guy. And hey, little girl. Hello. Whoa. Oh, oh, look at this over here. One finger. Woo! Did you see it? Like attached to my finger. Here, get a really good close. Oh, look at how big this one is. Okay, ready? Woo! Whee! Oh, it attaches to your finger and it's so soft. Oh, last but not least, starfish. Whoa. Whoa! They're really hard. It's so cool. And these are actually alive. They're real sea creatures. <laughs> they don't move very much, but they do move. Really slow. I really love the Marine Discovery Lab. <laughs>
See that? That is a howler monkey. Yeah. Do you see it? Yeah, right there. That is Bilbo, named after Bilbo Baggins. <laughs> That's funny. Let's act like monkeys together. <laughs> That's Lulu the rhinoceros. And Lulu is 21 years old. <laughs> yeah, Lulu, party! Woohoo! Yeah! <laughs> That's a toucan. Did you see its big beak? Kind of looks like a banana. Let's check out another animal. Oh, whoa, look at this. Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a tiger. Whoa, hello kitty. <laughs> whoa, come over here, turn around. Whoa, this is where the tigers live. Hey, and look at who it is over here. Looks like we're getting ready to do some training. The tiger is doing exactly what he's saying. It looks like they're having so much fun. Target. Target. Ooh, that was really cool. Did you see that? Hey, will you tell us why we just did that? Yeah, so. Uh, we train our animals so that um, they have the opportunity to make things easier for them and the staff. Mm -hmm. So we don't train our animals to do tricks, um, we do what we call behaviors. So for example, when I was having Jay target his nose to the end of this pole, um, it allowed me to move him to different positions so I could see different parts of his body. Um, having him stand up is not only impressive to see how big a tiger is, um, but it gives me the chance to see his underside. Because just like us, they can get injuries like cuts and bruises. So it lets me check up on his body to make sure he's still feeling good. Ooh, well thank you so much for showing me what you just showed me. You're very welcome. All right, see you later. Thanks. <laughs> let's go see some more stuff. Do you see that animal? It's another cat. This is a jaguar. Whoa. I have a pail of carrots and some tongs. And we just got told we need to feed the next animal. Come on. Whoa. Hey, check it out. These are cables that you have to be on this side of them. But we just got permission to head inside so we can feed the animals. Let's go. Okay, this is a short barrier. Interesting. That wasn't too hard to get in. Oh, I see the animal, look. Let's go through the trees. Whoa, hey look, look at the animal. We get a feed, check it out. Whoa, do you know what kind of animal this is? This is a tortoise. Let's feed the tortoises, yeah. 
check this out. This is a carrot and I'm using tongs because tortoises have really strong jaws and might bite my finger off. Here you go. Whoa! Oh, whoops, it slipped. <laughs> Here you go. Whoa! Okay, would you like a little bit more? Yeah? Okay, here you go. Oh, there you go. Whoa! This tortoise is about 550 pounds. Whoa! That is really heavy. Hey, and guess how old he is? Oh. He's 66 years old. Oh, that's really old. Oh, hello. Hey, check this out. I'll pet this tortoise's head. Hello, how are you? Whoa. Whoa. Look, the tortoise is off the ground. Do you see that? Because that allows for all the bugs and everything to get away from its underneath area. Whoa! Okay, let's go get some more carrots. Whoa, hello. How are you doing? Are you having a good day? Ooh, check it out. See this tortoise? This tortoise is a Galapagos tortoise, and it's a female. Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh, and here comes the male. Whoa, do you see how big he is? Oh, I'm getting trapped. Okay, I'm gonna loop right around here. See how this one's a little smaller? And this one is bigger? Whoa! This is a female, and this is a male. Whoa, hey! Do you two like each other? Yeah, you two look like your friends. <laughs> oh, would you like some more? Whoa! <laughs> Good job. Oh, you dropped it. <laughs> hey, come a little closer. Okay, here you go. All right. Eee, open wide. Here comes the carrot. Whoa. <laughs> there you go. Is that yummy? Hey. Tortoises like carrots, just like how I do. And carrots are nice and healthy. There you go. Whoa, you have a big mouth. <laughs> Whoa, look, I'm giving this tortoise a scratch, see? How does that feel? Does that feel good? Yeah. Do you see how the tortoise is standing on its legs really high in the air? In the wild, they do this because a lot of times they have bugs underneath them. And this allows for the finches, which are birds, go, go, to fly underneath there and then eat all of the bugs underneath this tortoise. Yeah, but for now, he's standing on his legs because this feels really good. It's kind of like when a grown up gives you a back scratch. Yeah, I like when my mom gives me a back scratch. Yeah, how does this feel? You like that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, my turn. Okay, my turn. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh no. Ooh, check this out. This is an armadillo. Okay, here you go. Run free. Whoa, look. An armadillo is one of the ambassador animals at the zoo. That means it's an animal that you can meet face to face. Whoa, hey, what are you doing? You want a treat? Armadillos love mealworms. Here you go. Uh-oh. Hey, come right over here. Here you go. Look, doesn't this armadillo look hard? Yeah, it is kind of hard. And it's not a shell. It's bone inside the armadillo's skin. Whoa. <laughs> okay. 
Ooh, this is Princess Buttercup. Ooh, all right, here you go. Here you go, Princess Buttercup. Ooh, look at Princess Buttercup's pretty little nails. Whoa. Okay, run free. Animal. What kind of animal is this? This is an Indian crested porcupine. Whoa! Look at all of its spines. Are those spines? The big ones are just to make her look scary, but the dangerous ones are down by her tail. Oh, okay, down there. Whoa. And what is she doing right now? We're just enjoying some snacks. Ooh. She likes a lot of plants, so we've got her some biscuits, mm -hmm. some yam, and some apple today. Ooh, that sounds pretty tasty, actually. Ooh. Let's take a closer look at the porcupine. Wow, you don't want to touch this animal on its tail. <laughs> This next area is really cool. Whoa, do you hear that? All these things are working really hard to keep this next area exactly like how the ocean is. Come here. Whoa, look at it. Whoa, there's so many filters and, and other things. It's so cool. Okay, come over here. Let me show you what it's doing. Yeah, this is Stingray Bay, and they're training the stingrays to do some pretty cool tricks. If you come to this zoo, you can use a flat, gentle hand and touch the stingrays on their back. But they're letting me go inside. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, first, I need to take off my shoes. One shoe. Whoa, two shoes. Okay, let's put those there. Can't forget about the socks because I'm gonna put these on. Whoa, they're like water socks or water shoes. Okay, let's put them on. All right, okay, okay, <laughs> I'm ready, here we go. You have to be nice and smooth and slow so you don't scare them. Oh, oh the water's nice and cold. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> okay. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. What's your name? My name is Mary, and this is Kelsey. We work here at the Phoenix Zoo. Woohoo! So, what are you doing right now? So, right now we're giving breakfast to our stingrays, and we're checking them to make sure everybody's healthy and happy this morning. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Can I help? Sure. Would you like to feed some? Ooh, yeah. Let's feed the stingrays. Okay. So Look at them. They <laughs> have shrimp and smelt. So you can take a couple and you can put it in your hand. Okay. Check out the food. Whoa! Looks so tasty. Okay, I put it in my hand. You're gonna hold it like an ice cream cone. Okay. Ooh, I like ice cream. <laughs> okay, just like that. Put it nice and deep into the water. They're gonna swim over your hand and they're gonna suck it out of your hand like a vacuum. Okay. Okay, here you go. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Look at that one. So you got a uh, blue spotted ribbon tail sitting on your feet. <laughs> okay. Do I go deeper in the water? Let's see what we can do. Oh, there Come you on, go. guys. Oh, I did it! Look, it's gone. <laughs> it sucked it right out of my hand. Can I do it again? You can. Yeah. Oh, oh, thank you. <laughs> they suck the food right out of my hand. It's kind of like, have you ever put a vacuum on your hand and then the vacuum sucks on your hand? That's kind of how it feels like when it's sucking the food out of your hand. Whoa, <laughs> 
That one just swam through my legs. <laughs> Whoa. Look at them. So okay. they're getting used to you now. So they can yeah. feel who you are by your heartbeat. Okay. They're understanding that you're not going to hurt them. And so they're coming closer and closer Whoa. as they're getting more and more comfortable with you. Yeah. Look at them. Hello. Whoa. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, that scared me. What happened there? They just got a little bit excited. Okay. Excited, not scared? Yeah. Okay. Because I kind of got scared. <laughs> But that's okay. They kind of seem really gentle. Oh, <laughs> whoa, whoa, there they go again. <laughs> Look at how wet I'm getting. <laughs> All right, let's feed some more. Hello, look at all of these stingrays. Whoa. <laughs> all right, bye-bye stingrays. Ooh, now we're gonna take a camel ride. <laughs> Have fun, Flippy. Thank you. Come on. Look, this is the top of the camel. See the hump? I'm gonna sit on top of it. Whoa! Now I'm on top of a camel. Okay, here we go. Check it out. Whee! Whoa! Hey! Look! I'm on the hump of the camel! Whoa! This is a nice camel! This is a dromedary camel! It's really high up here! Whoa! <laughs> I'm having so much fun! <laughs> Wee! Hello! Whoa! Check it out! See the hump of the camel? They store fat in here. And they can actually go about seven months without eating food. Or three to four weeks without drinking any water. That's pretty impressive, huh? Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! It has some pretty long legs, huh? And it has four legs. And you and I, have two. Whoa. All right, this is pretty fun. Whoa, <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, okay, let's go see some more animals. Now we're behind the scenes of the native Arizona exhibit. Ooh, check it out. Look, some tools. Hey, what does this look like? Kind of looks like a golf club. <laughs> but actually, see how it has a hook? It's used to handle certain types of reptiles, like a snake. Okay, but I'm not gonna use that because I'm not a trained professional. Ooh, check it out. Wow, some aquariums. <laughs> the fish are on the other side. We're behind the scenes. Whoa, look at this room. Whoa, this is a box. And this is where a snake lives. Let's read what kind it is. Rattlesnake. Venomous? <gasps> okay, I don't think I should handle that one. Cause like I said, I'm not a trained professional. <laughs> Let's find a snake that I can handle. Oh, this room's pretty cool. Whoa, there's so many cages right here. Whoa, what are these? These are snake sheds. Wow, every snake sheds its skin every couple months. Look at that, and they're all in one piece. Look, doesn't that look like a snake? Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Okay, okay. I'll keep these right here. OK, 
Okay. Yeah, this one looks like a good snake to handle. I'm handling a snake. Whoa, and look at the color of this snake. It's orange and white and black. Whoa. I used to be afraid of snakes when I was a child, but now I'm not. But some snakes you definitely don't want to hold. So if you ever see a snake in the wild, just to be safe, you probably shouldn't try and hold it like this. Okay, whoa! Look, are you having fun, snake? Whee! Hello! Hey! Whoa, look at it! Whoa! It's so intrigued with the camera! Whoa! This is awesome! We're behind the scenes of another reptile area. Whoa, there's so many cool tanks in here with so many unique creatures! Whoa! <laughs> hey! Whoa, look right here! Oh, hey! There's someone over here! Come here! Whoa! Hey, what are you doing? Just getting ready to check out one of our horned lizards. Did you want to hold him? Yeah! A horned lizard? That's cool! Okay. Okay, thank you. Whoa, look! This is a horned lizard. Check out its horns. Wow. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh, and he's just hanging out. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, there you go. That was awesome. Good job. Let's go. My height. Hello, hello. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. A lion? Mm -hmm. Ooh, an elephant. <laughs> Whoa, look! <laughs> this is a gorilla. <laughs> and some snakes? Yeah, I gotta hold a snake. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. Okay, follow me. Ooh, there's even a dinosaur. A Tyrannosaurus Rex. Interesting. Well, hey, that was so much fun learning about animals with you at the zoo. This is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. Good job. All right. See you later. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at where I'm at today. Today, I'm at Woodland Park Zoo in Seattle, Washington. Have you ever been to a zoo? Yeah, they're so great. You can see big animals, small animals, even insects if you want. Yeah, I am so excited. Let's go. Whoa, we're in the back of a habitat. This is so cool. Whoa, look at this. Ooh, looks like some animal snacks. Yum. Okay, I'll put that down right there. Wow, and this is this animal's real food. Yeah, this is what they eat on the daily. Hey, check it out. See this right here? Yeah, you just put some powder in right there, swirl it around, and this is what this animal loves to eat every day. Okay, let me put this back right here. But hey, did you see what we saw right here? 
Whoa! Looks like a feather! This must come from the animal that's in this habitat! Hmm, yeah, feather. Birds have feathers. And do you see? It's the color pink! Whoa! Do you know what animal, bird, is the color pink? Yeah, flamingos! Okay, let me set this down right here. <laughs> and then, let's grab the snacks, and let's go see if we can find the flamingos. Oh, hey, it's John! Hey! Oh, hi, Blippi. How are you? Good, welcome to our flamingo exhibit. Thank you, what are you doing? I'm um, just raking up the feathers, oh. and these are our flamingos. Oh, do you see the flamingos? Wow. Do you mind if I get a closer look at them? No, go ahead. All right. Whoa. Hey, let's take a closer look at the flamingos. Oh, hello, flamingos. Hey. Wow, these flamingos are so pretty. Whoa, did you know that when flamingos are born, they're the color white? Yeah, gray, yeah, whitish gray. And then when they get older, they turn the color pink because the food that they eat has a lot of pink in it. Whoa, that is so cool. And you see how tall their legs are? Whoa, they're so long. An adult flamingo, the legs are taller than the whole rest of the body. Wow, that is so crazy. Hey, and do you see how their legs are bending backwards? Yeah, us humans, our legs bend forward. But then, flamingos, their legs bend backwards. And you're probably like, whoa, those are some flexible knees. <laughs> but hey, let me tell you a really cool fact. Do you see that little area right in the center of their legs? Yeah, it looks like their knee. That is actually the flamingo's ankle. Whoa, that's crazy. Well, hey, I think we should throw some of these snacks in the water and see if the flamingos come. Okay. <laughs> All right, here you go. It's the Animal Ambassador Show. This place is awesome! Hey, what's your name? I'm Susie. Oh, nice to meet you. And who is this? This is Harry. And Harry is a striped skunk. Wow, striped skunk? Yeah, I see black and white. Why are they striped like that? Well, those stripes allow them to alert any predators in the area that he is a skunk. And if they've been around a skunk before, they definitely would not want to get sprayed again. Oh, yeah. Wait, you said spray. Is that the smell that you sometimes smell when you're driving? You've got it, yeah, it's a really strong smell and you can't mistake it if you've smelled it before and you definitely can't mistake it if you've been sprayed. <laughs> yeah, so why do they spray again? It's their way of defending themselves. So if a skunk feels threatened, the first thing that Harry might do is do some forward charges or some handstands and that says, hey, don't mess with me, more bad things are coming and if the animal proceeds to come forward, they might get sprayed. Oh, so it sounds like Harry's a gym gymnast with its handstands. That's funny. What's Harry eating? Today he is eating insects. He loves bugs, he loves vegetables, fruit. He even eats meat too. Wow, Harry is so cool. I love skunks. <laughs> This is Eduardo. Hello, Eduardo. Whoa, Eduardo is a three-banded armadillo. Whoa, and it looks like he's eating some insects. Those look so yummy for him. <laughs> I actually got permission to go inside, but he's actually probably gonna think my shoes are really cool because they smell. So let me go inside and see if he is curious. Hello. Hey, how are you? Whoa, do you see him? Whoa, he has a very hard shell. Yeah, three-banded armadillos are ones that can go all the way in a ball. But he's not doing that right now because that 
is a defensive mechanism. Yeah, he's actually really comfortable right now. <laughs> hey! Do you see how he's just sniffing around? Oh, he is so cute! And his fingernails are so long, or toenails. And he has some cute little hairs coming out the bottom. <laughs> Whoa, look at him go! Whoa, check it out! Look, this is a hawk! But wait a second, who are you? My name is Lindsay. I am an ambassador animal keeper. Wow, what, what's the name of this hawk? This is Cisco. He is a 32-year-old Paris's hawk. Wow, Cisco is so pretty. Wow, I love the wings. Does it have big wings or thin or small? Or? He has big, broad wings that are good for soaring, but not very good for diving fast. Oh, wow. Do they live together or alone? Harris's hawks are very special because they live in family groups with other hawks. Most birds of prey live by themselves. Oh, wow. And I like Cisco's eyes. What's unique about them? Harris's hawks and other birds of prey have really great eyesight. That is so cool. And I like its beak. Look at it. It's like, shh, looks so sharp. Can I take a closer look at it? Sure. Whoa. Check out Cisco. Wow. Whoa, so majestic. Wow. Hey, Cisco. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> wow! Another amazing animal! Whoa! This is a burrowing owl. Whoa! What's his name? This is Papu. Oh, nice to meet you, Papu. I'm Flippy. Do you see Papu's eyes? They're so big and yellow. Wow, does that mean they can see good? Owls have excellent eyesight. Wow. And Papu is so small. Is it a little baby? No, Papu is full grown. Whoa. Is it like other owls where they go out at night and look for food? So other owls are nocturnal, which means they're awake at night. But Papu is diurnal. He's awake during the day. Whoa. That is so cool. Papu is so cute. Wow, I just want to pet him. He's so cute, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> Can I take a closer look? Sure. Wow, check it out. This is Anahi. Yeah, she is so pretty. Wow. Do you see her tongue poking out? Yeah, she pushes her tongue out of her mouth every now and then to smell. Isn't that crazy? We use our nose to smell, <laughs> but she uses her tongue to smell. Yeah, and she is a red-tailed boa constrictor. Whoa, look at her just wrapped up in a tree like this, all comfortable. Whoa, hello. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I hope she is having a great day. Whoa, she is so big. Right now, she is about seven feet tall. Yeah, that's about 2.3 meters long. Whoa, but she actually gets a lot bigger. She'll even get bigger than this. Whoa, yeah. She can get about 12 feet tall. That's about four meters long. Whoa, that is so... Cool! <laughs> wow! Check it out! This is Blue, and Blue is a blue-tongued skink! <laughs> she looks like a snake, doesn't she? Yeah, a snake with legs! <laughs> but she's not. She's actually a lizard! Wow! She is so cool looking! Whoa, do you see her tongue? Yeah, it's the color blue! That makes sense. I bet predators think that that tongue could be poisonous. Yeah. Whoa, and do you see her ears? Wow, I bet she can hear really good. <laughs> Whoa, geez, how are you? Are you having a good day? <laughs> Whoa. Wow, look, this is Tut. 
And this is Cairo. Whoa, look at them. Hey! They are Egyptian tortoises. Yeah, when I hear tortoise, I think of a big turtle. But these are actually full size. Whoa, where are you two going? I wonder if they're hungry. <laughs> they actually live in the desert. Yeah. Whoa. That makes sense because Egyptian tortoises. Whoa. Look, they're following each other. Whoa, that looks fun. <laughs> Hasn't this been so much fun at Woodland Park Zoo in Seattle, Washington today? Yeah, I had a lot of fun seeing all these great animals. Hey, what's your favorite animal? Whoa, what a great animal! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I. P-P-I! Flippy! Good job! Alright, see you again! Bye bye Hey everyone! It's me, Flippy! And I'm with my best friend, Mika! Hi everyone! We're at the Aquarium of the Pacific in Long Beach, California. Yeah. And it's actually nighttime, and this place is closed. Yeah, so we got special permission to be here at night. Yeah. <gasps> that gives me a great idea. Why? Let's have night at the aquarium. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. <laughs> I go be Mika. Have fun. See ya. Thank you. Whoa. Whoa. Check it out! It looks like a spider crab. Yeah, it looks like a giant red spider, but it's a crab. Yeah! And check it out, Mika. Looks like it has some claws. Yeah, oh. pictures. <laughs> <laughs> it also looks like it's looking right at you, Blippi. Whoa! Hello! Hi! Hey, my name's Blippi. Hey, What's your Mika. name? <laughs> yeah. Okay, maybe it doesn't have a name. <laughs> have you ever seen a crab walk on the ocean floor? Yeah, they walk sideways. Yeah. Will you act like crabs with us? Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Woo, woo. <laughs> woo, I like being a crab. Ooh, me too. <laughs> wow. wow. Check it out. So pretty. Yeah, do you know what they are? Yeah! And look, they're the shape of a star! Yeah! That makes sense. <laughs> Shall we count how many points it has? Yeah, let's do it! One, two, three, four, five! Wow! Looks like they're just stuck to the rock like this! Yeah. <laughs> they seem to really like it. They're all hugging this rock. I like acting like a sea star. <laughs> Just like it, <laughs> That's silly. Well, shall we keep exploring? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Whoa, look at this big tank. Wow, you're right. <gasps> so much water in here. Whoa. Whoa, check it out, Mika. Fish. Wow, they're all swimming together. Yeah. Here they go. These are yellow tails. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. If you look really close, you see that their tails are yellow. Yeah! Whoa, there's so many of them! Wow, I think they like us. They yeah. keep coming over. <laughs> Do you know what a big group of fish is called? Yeah, a, a school. school. Cool! <laughs> Hello! Whoa! Whoa. <gasps> Mika, look it? way over here! Come on! Do you see what it is? Wow, sea otters are so cool. Whoa. Wow. They're in the water. Hey. They can see us. 
swim in the water and be on land. Yeah! And their fur is really, really dense. Yeah! Oh, look! They're snuggling. Oh, they're so cute! Hey! I wonder if they're best friends. Like us! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Their hair is so dense. Actually, it's fur. Yeah. yeah! There's about a million pieces of hair in about that big of size. That's Super duper furry. Yeah! <laughs> that's equal to about all the hair on an average sized dog. Wow, that's a lot of fur. Yeah! Whoa! They like to dive down and find their food, things like shellfish, crab, clams, yeah. sea urchins. Yep, and they'll bring it up out of the water onto a rock and hang out and eat their food. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> <laughs> and did you see how their front hands? Kind of look like hands, but their back feet, yeah, they're actually kind of flippers. Yeah. <laughs> so then they swim with their back flipper feet. Yep, <laughs> it's like flippers in the back and paws in the front. Yeah, check them out. Well, there it goes. Wow, <gasps> check it out. They're so tiny. Yeah, teeny tiny jellyfish. Wow, look at them go. They're just swimming like this. Whoop, 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 whoop. Yeah, I've <laughs> never seen them this small before. I know, they're so small. <laughs> oh, and look over here, Mika. Whoa. Whoa, these are a little bit bigger. Yeah, we can call these medium-sized jellyfish. <laughs> That's right. Wow, look at their long tentacles. Whoa. Oh, hello. Hi. How's your day going? <laughs> Whoa, Mika, look! Wow! Big jellyfish! Yeah! Wow! Look at that! Yeah! Jellyfish are so cool! They don't have hearts, they don't have brains, but they need to eat food to survive! Yeah! They're living creatures! That's right! Wow! That is so cool. And if you ever see a jellyfish, you want to make sure not to touch it because they sting. Yeah. Wow. Oh, hello. <laughs> and do you see the brown tentacles? Looks like hair. Yeah. That hair tentacle looking type of things, that's what actually stings you if you touch it. Good thing this is glass. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> oh, see you later, jellyfish. Wow. <laughs> Pretty. So we saw small jellyfish, mm -hmm. medium-sized jellyfish, and big jellyfish. Yeah! <laughs> oh, look over here! Oh, come on! Whoa! Wow! Whoa, look at that! Hey! Hello! I'm Blippi! I'm Mika! <laughs> and this is a puffin! Wow! Oh. Hi, buddy! Look at him just floating on top of the water! Yeah! Oh. See you later! <laughs> because they can dive down into the water and catch a lot of fish. Yeah! Ten fish is pretty normal for them to catch in one dive. Yeah! yeah. And do you see those rocks up there? Yeah, that's where they live. Yep, see? All the way up top, they're just hanging out together on the rocks. Yep. Yeah, if there's a cliff next to water, you might find some puffins. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, puffin! Hey! Whoa! Their beaks look so cool. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. So colorful in there. Yeah, it's a coral reef. Yeah. <laughs> Do you see all those fish? They're so colorful. Yeah, there's a lot in there. Yeah, ooh, look at that one right there. It's just yellow. So yellow, it looks like the sun. Yeah, it's so bright. <laughs> Woo! Oh, Flippy, I bet you'd like that one over there because it's orange, one of your favorite colors. Oh yeah, you're right. And there's white stripes on it and black. That one looks really cool. <laughs> yeah. Woo! And that one right there, yeah, has a blue body and a yellow tail. Oh, cool. Whoa! Ooh, you see any other colorful ones, Mika? Hmm. Oh, I see a black and white one coming this way. Oh yeah, black and white stripes? Yeah, almost like a zebra. <laughs> yeah, that is so cool. 
Ooh, and look at that one right there. Ooh. Wow. Yeah, a blue body with some black and a yellow tail. Wow. There are so many colors in here. Yeah, so colorful. <laughs> Look at this! These are some of the teeniest, tiniest frogs I have ever seen. These are poisonous dart frogs and can typically be found in the rainforest. Do you know what color that is? Yeah, it's like a red orange. Poisonous dart frogs come in so many different sorts of colors and their bright colors tell animals and people to stay away because they're really poisonous, but they're so cute. <laughs> Ooh, I think there's some more over here. Come on. Wow. These have white stripes down their back. They look so cool. They're poisonous because of the poison in the food that they eat. <laughs> you have to stay away. But wow, they're just really adorable and fabulous. <laughs> Mika, look. <laughs> Check it out. More frogs. Whoa! These are magnificent tree frogs. Whoa! It's the color green. Yeah! That's called camouflage. It blends in with its environment. Yeah, do you know what is green in here? Yeah, leaves. Whoa! So then other animals can't see those frogs. So cool! <laughs> Ooh, and look down here. These are Mexican salamanders. Yeah, also known as oxalotls. What a silly name. Whoa, hello. Yeah, they're typically darkish, greenish, brownish in the nature. Yeah, so then they blend in to their environment, just like those frogs. Yeah, <laughs> see you later. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Yeah, it's an octopus. Can you see it? Yeah. Whoa. Octopuses have eight arms. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> we, together, have four. One, two, three, four. Whoa. Times that by two, and then you have eight. <laughs> yeah, can you imagine having eight arms? Whoa, that'd be so cool. Yeah, and octopuses have little suction cups on their arms so that they can taste wherever they go. Yeah, and it sticks to things. Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. <laughs> and octopuses can actually change color and texture. That's called camouflage. Yeah, and they're also really, really smart. <laughs> yeah, and did you know octopuses, their mouths are actually beaks. <laughs> oh, look. Oh. It looks really white now. It's wow. kind of hard to see back there. Yeah, it's oh, changing it's colors. Oh, hello, octopus. Hi. Oh, take a closer look. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. bunch of sharks. Yeah. Wow. But wow. I actually heard that we can get in. What? Yeah. That's so cool. Shall we? Yeah. Okay. Whoa. Need to be very careful. Do not step on any of these sharks. Excuse us. Excuse us. Ooh. Ooh, it's a little cold and chilly. Whoa. Wow. Yeah, these are shark jaws. Yeah. And look at all the teeth. There's so many teeth. Whoa, yeah. hello. For sharp. Yeah. Whoa. Are they sharp? Whoa, yeah, they are. Look at this really big one. Whoa, Mika, cool. Wow. <laughs> wow. And this shark jaw. Yeah, the teeth are really small. This jaw is actually the same type of sharks in here. Yeah. So cute. Much <laughs> smaller than something like this. Yeah. 
and look at this! Bet you can't guess what shark this comes from, Mika. Uh, it's one tooth, and it comes from a shark that's really big. It's a really great shark. Oh, the great white shark, Flippy? Yeah! Whoa, look how big that tooth Whoa. is! Oh, no! <laughs> ah, chomp, 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 chomp. <laughs> so silly. Wow. Yeah. So, Mika, we can actually touch these sharks. Whoa. Yeah. I wonder what they feel like. I know. I'm so excited. Oh. Hello, shark. Hello. Hello. Come here. Are you ready to get pet? Oh, yeah. are a little shy. Oh, here's oh. one. Here one comes. Come on over. Oh, yeah. I did. What did, did you feel like? It actually felt a little rough. Yeah, the skin of these sharks feel like sandpaper. Oh, it's so rough. Whoa. Oh, here's one. Oh, oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, here's one for you, Mika. Here you go. Whoa. Oh, it's rough. Not smooth at all. No. Nope. <laughs> hey, come check out over here. What's over here? Yeah. Whoa. Get out nice and safe. Hey. Then. Go right over here. <laughs> yeah. Check it out. Whoa. A Ray. bunch of rays. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, look at them. Whoa. Hey, Ray, how are you? Hi. Whoa. <laughs> Shall we get in? Yes, I can't wait. Yeah. Here we go. Wow. Whoa. So in here, you want to shuffle your feet, so then you don't step on any of the rays. Yeah, good idea. Ooh. Ooh, push up, push up, push. Look right over there, Mika. Is this food for the rays? It is. Wow. Special surprise. It's a <laughs> Yeah. Ooh, and is there another one? Yep, this is oh. for you. Oh, thank you so much. And this is for me. All right. So how we feed them is we just toss it out. Look at this. Ooh, <laughs> some fish in here. Anybody hungry? Looks like some shrimp. Ooh, check it out. Wow. Want some food? Looks pretty yummy if you were a ray, huh? <laughs> Whoa, Can here I they are. Yum! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Nice dog snack. Yeah, here you go, rays. Ooh. Actually, we can touch them too. Really? What yeah. do they feel like? Whoa, what do you tell me? Yeah. You want to do... Two fingers along their back. Okay. Nice and soft. Oh, there's one behind us. Oh, hey, Ray. Whoop. Oh, here's one. Hello. Hi. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, cool. Looks like he gave you a high five. Cool. It actually kind of feels like, let's see here. Oh. <laughs> I don't know yet. <laughs> oh, here you go. <laughs> yep, I felt that one. Yeah, different than the sharks that were really rough. Yeah, these are really smooth and I slippery. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> so silly! <laughs> wow, now they really want to eat. Yeah, they kind of look like uh, diamonds. Yeah. yeah. And they flap their wings. <laughs> oh, he's trying to eat my foot. <laughs> Wow, that was so much fun. Yeah, what a great night at the aquarium. Yeah, we saw so many cool animals. Yeah, like those adorable sea otters. <laughs> and those jellyfish. <laughs> and the octopus. Whoa, with eight arms. Yeah. Wow, and those crabs. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was so much fun. Yeah, so many <laughs> underwater creatures. Yeah, well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. Good job. Wait a second, Mika, how do you spell your name? Oh, I'll show you. N-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> so cool. See you later. See you soon. Bye bye. <laughs> Have a great night, Blippi and Mika. Thank you. See ya. Come on, everyone. Let's
Let's make learning fun. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout. Blippi!